Saving $10,000 as stated in this video is beyond the act of saving this exact amount. In this video, you will learn how to build a lasting saving habit practically. This habit is also beyond financial terms. It will help you achieve success in every other area of your life. Subscribe to the channel as we embark on the journey to build valuable habits that can shape your life for the best. The main goal of this video is to build a financial freedom habit. Is $10,000 realistically too big for you to save in six months due to your current income? Don't stress your mental health. If you don't earn enough, please set a realistic goal and make sure you hit it. Please commit to coming back to this video to write in the comment section, I made it. Before we move to the exact steps to take in this journey of saving $10,000 in six months, you need to believe you can do it and focus on achieving it by avoiding every distraction facing you right now and distractions that will come your way. Now let's dive into the practical steps to take. Step 1. Determine your monthly savings goal. First, calculate how much you must save each month. The total savings goal is $10,000 in 6 months. The monthly saving goal is $10,000 divided by 6, which equals $1,667. By consistently setting aside this amount each month, you can steadily work towards your target amount, ensuring you reach your savings goal within the desired time frame. Breaking down your savings goal into manageable monthly increments makes the target more achievable and helps you track your progress over time. It allows you to stay focused on your financial objective and adjust your budget and spending habits accordingly to ensure that you are on track to meet your goal. By committing to saving $1,667 every month for the next six months, you are taking a proactive step towards building a solid financial foundation and achieving your desired savings milestone. Consistent saving habits combined with effective budgeting can help you reach your financial goals and secure your future. Step 2. Assess your income and expenses. To save $1,667 monthly, calculate your total monthly income. This includes your salary, income from side jobs and other sources such as rental income, investment dividends, or alimony. For example, if you receive $4,000 from your main job, $500 from a side job, and $200 from other sources, your total monthly income would be $4,700. Next, list all your monthly expenses, which fall into two categories, fixed and variable. Fixed expenses remain the same each month. These include your rent or mortgage, utility bills, insurance payments, loan repayments, and any subscriptions you have. For instance, if your rent is on $1,200, utilities cost $200, insurance is $150, loan payments are $300, and subscriptions amount to $50 your total fixed expenses would be $1 to $900. Variable expenses, on the other hand, can change from month to month. These include groceries, dining out, entertainment, transportation, and miscellaneous expenses such as clothing and personal care. Suppose you spend $400 on groceries, $200 on dining out, $150 on entertainment, $100 on transportation, and $50 on miscellaneous items. In this case, your total variable expenses would be $900. Add your fixed and variable expenses together to find your total monthly expenses. Continuing with the example, your total expenses would be a $1,900 fixed plus $900 variable equaling to $800. Subtract your monthly expenses from your monthly income to determine your current savings. In this scenario, $4,700 income minus $2,800 expenses leaves you with $1,900 in monthly savings. To ensure you save on 667 each month, you need to compare this target with your current savings. If your current savings are already greater than or equal to 1667, as in the example where you save under $900, you are on track. However, if your savings fall short, you need to make adjustments. To increase your savings, start by looking at your variable expenses. Consider reducing how often you dine out, choosing less expensive entertainment options, and planning your grocery shopping to avoid unnecessary purchases. You might also review your fixed expenses to see if there are areas where you can save. This could involve finding cheaper insurance plans, canceling rarely used subscriptions, or negotiating lower rent. Increasing your income is another way to boost your savings. You might take on extra work, freelance, or sell items you no longer need. Asking for a raise or looking for a better paying job can also help. Let's imagine your monthly budget is like a delicious pizza. To save one to learn 667 monthly, you must carefully slice this pizza. First, determine how much pizza you have in your monthly income. 
Let's say you earn $5,000 a month. Next, think about how you divide your pizza. Usually you spend a portion on essentials like rent, utilities, groceries, and transportation. This might take up half of your pizza, around $2,500. Another part of your pizza goes to wants, such as eating out, entertainment, shopping, and hobbies, which could be about $1,500. Normally, you would save the remaining part, which might be around $1,000. However, to save $1,667, you need to adjust your slices. Try to reduce your essentials to two $250 by cutting back on things you don't need. For your wants, trim it down to $100. This way, you can increase your savings slice to $1,667. To make this manageable and even fun, consider using a budgeting app to track where your money goes, like keeping an eye on your pizza slices, Cooking more at home can save money just like making your own pizza instead of ordering one. Look for free or low-cost ways to have fun, similar to enjoying pizza with friends without extra toppings. And keep a clear goal in mind for what you're saving for, which can be as exciting as a yummy dessert after your meal. By adjusting your pizza slices a bit and monitoring your expenses, you can save one 667 each month. By thoroughly tracking your income and expenses and making thoughtful adjustments, you can achieve your goal of saving one through 60 severs each month. This process involves understanding exactly where your money is going and making strategic choices to cut costs or increase earnings. Step three, allocate cash to envelopes. Picture yourself embarking on a thrilling treasure hunt to save one to six and 67 monthly. To assist you in this adventure, you're equipped with two distinct maps, tangible and digital. On the physical map, within the essentials envelope, Safeguard 2D250 dollars to cover vital expenses such as rent and groceries. Discover one or a hundred dollars tucked away in the wants envelope, reserved for leisurely pursuits and enjoyable experiences. The savings envelope is your vault, securing one on six sixty seven dollar monthly to fortify your financial future. On the digital map, allocate two two hundred fifty dollars to the essentials account to cover essential expenses. Transfer one to one hundred dollars to the wants account, allowing indulgent pleasures and delightful treats. Channel one to six to sixty-seven into the savings account, where your wealth accumulates steadily. Navigate your way through these maps with precision. Remain steadfast on your journey, meticulously monitoring your expenditures. Steer clear of distractions that may veer you off course. Make adjustments to your maps if necessary to guarantee you reach your savings objective. With these detailed maps as your guide, your pursuit of financial prosperity promises to be an exhilarating and rewarding expedition. Tips for success. First, use the SMART strategy to set a realistic goal for yourself. Let's add some flavor to the SMART goal-setting framework. Dim. Specific. Imagine your goal as a treasure map with clear directions to the treasure chest. Each landmark on the map represents a specific aspect of your goal. The more detailed your map, the easier to navigate towards success. M. Measurable. Picture your goal as a delicious recipe. Just like a recipe lists precise measurements for ingredients, your goal should have quantifiable metrics. Think of these metrics as the ingredients needed to create your desired outcome. At the achievable, think of your goal as a mountain you want to climb. While reaching the summit may seem daunting, choosing a challenging yet conquerable mountain with the right preparation and determination is essential, relevant. Envision your goal as a puzzle piece that fits perfectly into the bigger picture of your life or your organization's mission. Like a puzzle, each piece contributes to the overall picture, making it meaningful and significant. T. Time-bound. Imagine your goal as a thrilling race against time. Just like a runner strives to reach the finish line within a specific time frame, your goal should have a deadline that creates a sense of urgency and keeps you focused on progressing. Putting it all together, setting smart goals is like embarking on a grand adventure. Mapping out your journey, measuring your progress, choosing challenges wisely, aligning with your greater purpose, and racing against time to achieve success. Dear friend, this smart analysis is to guide you in your unique savings goal. Be sincere about the achievable yet challenging amount and time frame you can set for yourself. The $10,000 in six-month time frame are examples and may not apply to every viewer here. You can do more or less but be sincere. The same strategy and commitment you use to achieve your first goal will guide you toward the next. Look for more ways to earn. When your paycheck barely leaves room for saving, it's time to explore new avenues for boosting your income. Consider delving into your passions and hobbies to uncover hidden earning potential. Whether you're a wizard with crafts, a photography enthusiast, or a gaming aficionado, there's likely a market for your talents. 
Take stock of your belongings. That spare room, idle gear, or unused items could be transformed into income streams through renting or selling. Embrace the digital age and leverage online platforms to monetize your skills. From completing surveys to creating content on platforms like YouTube or Twitch, the Internet offers many opportunities to supplement your earnings. Invest in yourself by acquiring new skills or enhancing existing ones. This could lead to higher paying job opportunities or enable you to freelance in specialized fields. Additionally, keep an eye out for part-time work or side hustles that align with your interests and schedule, providing an extra financial boost without overwhelming your current commitments. By diversifying your income streams and tapping into your creativity and expertise, you can pave the way for greater financial stability and future savings growth. Stay disciplined. Think of your budget as your financial superhero, swooping in to save the day and rescue your bank account from chaos. But even superheroes need sidekicks, and that's where discipline comes in. Imagine you've set up this fortress of financial stability with your budget. You've carefully allocated your income, divvied up your expenses, and even created a special savings envelope for emergencies or future adventures. Now here's the tricky part, sticking to it. Picture your savings envelope as a treasure chest guarded by a fierce dragon. It's filled with your hard-earned gold coins, each representing your hopes and dreams for the future. Now temptation comes knocking at your door, disguised as that shiny new gadget or an irresistible sale. But beware, giving in means facing the wrath of that dragon and risking the safety of your treasure. Staying disciplined is like summoning your inner warrior to stand strong against temptation. It's about channeling your willpower to resist the urge to dip into your savings for anything other than its intended purpose. Every time you say no to impulse spending, you reinforce your financial fortress and ensure your treasure remains safe and untouched. Remember, being disciplined isn't always easy. It takes courage, perseverance, and a dash of superhero strength. But with each victory over temptation, you're not just building good financial habits, crafting a legacy of financial resilience and security for yourself. So embrace your inner superhero, stay disciplined, and let your budget be your guide to financial freedom. Automate savings. Imagine your savings as a plant that needs regular watering to grow big and strong. Automating your savings is like setting up a magical sprinkler system that nourishes your financial garden without you even lifting a finger. Here's how it works. You decide how much money you want to save each month, and like magic, it disappears from your checking account and reappears in your savings account, all on its own. No need to remember to transfer money manually or resist the urge to spend it. It's done for you like clockwork. Think of it as a sneaky little trick to outsmart your impulse spending tendencies. By squirreling away your savings before you even have a chance to miss it, you're creating a safety net for yourself without even realizing it. So go ahead, set up those automatic transfers and watch your savings grow effortlessly. Before you know it, you'll have a lush financial garden blooming with possibilities. All thanks to the power of automation. Stay motivated. Picture yourself at the finish line of a marathon, cheering crowds and victory within reach. That's what staying motivated feels like when you're chasing after your $10,000 savings goal. Imagine the possibilities. A dream vacation, a down payment on a new car, or simply the peace of mind knowing you have a solid financial cushion. Every dollar you save brings you one step closer to turning those dreams into reality. But let's be real. Staying motivated isn't always a walk in the park. It's easy to get sidetracked by daily distractions or tempted to splurge on something fun in the moment. That's where keeping your goal front and center comes in. Visualize your savings goal as a beacon of light, guiding you through the darkness of temptation. Remember all the amazing things you can do once you hit that $10,000 milestone. Whether writing it down, creating a vision board, or setting a reminder on your phone, find a way to keep your goal visible and tangible. And don't forget to celebrate your progress along the way. Every dollar saved is a victory worth acknowledging. Treat yourself to a small reward or indulge in a little celebration to keep your motivation levels high. So, when the going gets tough, remember why you started and keep your eyes on the prize? With determination, focus, and a sprinkle of positivity, you'll reach that $10,000 savings target before you know it. By following these steps and maintaining discipline, you can successfully save $10,000 in six months using the envelope-style budgeting method or any suitable method. Before this challenge, clear all debts. Use this challenge to save up your emergency fund. Next, continue this challenge to build your assets. Once you build this habit, you can easily scale up to 100K, 1 and so on. Imagine your financial journey as a thrilling adventure, 
with each challenge bringing you closer to your ultimate goal of financial freedom. But before you embark on this epic quest, laying the groundwork for success is essential. First stop, clear all debts. Think of it as shedding excess baggage before starting your grand adventure. By eliminating debt, you're freeing yourself from the burden of interest payments and creating a solid foundation for building wealth. Now let's move on to the main event, saving up your emergency fund. This is your safety net, your lifeline in times of need. Picture it as a fortress protecting you from life's unexpected curveballs. Whether it's a sudden medical expense or a car repair, your emergency fund has your back. Once you've conquered the challenge of saving your emergency fund, it's time to level up. Use the momentum you've gained to continue building your assets. Think of it as adding fuel to the fire of your financial growth. Whether you're investing in stocks, real estate, or starting a business, each step forward brings you closer to your ultimate goal. And here's the best part. Once you've built this habit of saving and investing, you can easily scale up to even greater heights. 100K, one lima dollars, the sky's the limit. It's all about harnessing the power of consistency and discipline to turn your financial dreams into reality. So gear up, adventurer. The path to financial freedom awaits. With each challenge you conquer, you're one step closer to claiming victory. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button, share it, and comment below. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day or night.